Hi, I'm Simon with AppliancePartsPros.com. Today we're going to show you how to repair your appliance. Are you ready? Remember, anytime you work on your appliance, make sure it's unplugged or the circuit breakers are off so there's no chance of electrocution. In this video, we'll show you how to replace the ice maker water line fitting in a GE refrigerator. It's going to be a very easy repair, should only take a few minutes to show you how to do it. For this job, we're going to need a pair of needle nose pliers and a putty knife. When you open up the package, you're going to get a new ice maker water line fitting. The ice maker water line fitting is located at the back of the refrigerator in the upper left corner. It connects the water inlet line to the ice maker inlet tube. The main reason to replace the fitting is if it's cracked, causing a water leak. So here we are at the back of the fridge, and this is the part that we are going to replace. This is the ice maker water line fitting. I'm going to squeeze this uh, clip with needle nose pliers. Uh, be prepared, it's going to play a little trick on you. And I'm going to slide it down. Okay, let it go. And now I'm going to pull this water line out of the fitting. Now I'm going to use the putty knife to free that uh, fitting. It has a uh, uh, a glue attached to that and it's glued to the surface of the fridge and I'm gonna cut it off and pull it out this is the old ice maker water line fitting next to the new one if you don't have this part you can get it from appliancepartspros.com all right so we're gonna install this new piece and uh, we need to peel off this protective uh, layer of paper. We expose the glue. Don't touch this side. And we're going to install it in there. Well, definitely you need to cover the opening completely. And push it in and let it glue. All right. Next, we're going to insert this uh, water line inside the fitting push it in all the way all right now i'm going to insert that clip over the tube for that purpose i'm going to use these pliers again i'm going to squeeze the clip and place it over the tube we're done Plug the fridge back in and make sure it's cooling. Thank you for being a part of another successful repair brought to you by AppliancePartsPros.com. For any of your future appliance repair projects, please check out our other videos available on our site, on Facebook, on YouTube, and on Instagram.